this video I'll be doing a DIY battery pack a 24 volts a 7s 10p I've prepared the pack already and also the bus bars I've cut them up already the way it's been laid out it's negative positive negative positive negative positive negative this whole row is negative this whole row is positive this whole row is negative and so on and so on this would be a 24 volts i'd be constructing without a bms before we begin if you're new to this channel please like comment subscribe click on the bell icon so you'll be notified of further videos anything i use or show in this video i'll have a link in the description that if you order from my link i'll get a small commission at no extra cost to you which would help the channel go a long way with all that said let me start placing the bars I think the iron I will be soldering this on and not using the spot welder simply because I started I started it already before I got the spot welder the iron isn't hot yet this is a uh, hundred and fifty watts a soldering iron
I will pause the video and continue welding and when I'm through with this side or when I'm I reach to the last one I'll turn the video back on because it will go on very long I have completed this side this is what it looked like and uh, this I put tie wrap here and here to hold the last one in place this is the last one a tie wrap here and the other tie wrap down here to hold it secure in place on this one I'll put a heat shrink and I'll cut it and I'll bend it so I've tested each and every one to make sure it's connected properly with a multi meter and now I'll be going on the other side I've got this piece of pro prospect here so I'll be turning it over and starting on this side I'll be using this for my fuse wire I'd be putting fuses only on one side not the other side the fuse would be on the positive side let me okay <coughs> let me start the Disorder right now. That is what it is when you are not careful. So I'll continue soldering this side and uh, I'll start back the video again when I finish putting these on. 
Yeah, I've completed the other side and I put two tie wraps here, one there, one there. Whenever you're doing the soldering, always cover the rest of the pack because if you don't earlier i had a mishap a good thing the fuse was low enough that it blew the, the fuse wire touch the other side and it's only on the positive huh? side I have a fused the negative side isn't fused Just going through and make sure all the fuse wire is connected and I'll do that for the whole pack. I use this for continuity and I'm using this one a voltage check twenty eight point nine volts. No I'll pause the video and I'll put some connectors on the end and then I'll resume. Yeah, I've completed the pack. This is it. I put these uh, lug nuts on them. I will try to secure, protect that for now. The only problem is I don't have a charger to charge it. The IMAX is not going up to 7. Although I'll try the IMAX, but it will do it as a, a 1P, 1S. I think I might put balance leads on it, but since I doesn't have a charger, that could go to 24 volts. I'll leave it at that. Next thing I'm going to do is put my inverter on it. The inverter is 24 volts and see how good it would handle it. If you find this video was helpful, please like, comment, subscribe, click on the bell icon so you'll be notified of other videos. Anything I use in this video I'll have it in the link. If you order from me, I'll get a small commission at no extra cost to you. Thank you. Goodbye until the next one.